Democratic presidential contender Barack Obama has decided to discontinue a political tradition that has been the uh, norm for some since September 12, 2001, wearing an American flag pin on his lapel. The, the Illinois senator said, quote, shortly after 9-11, particularly because as we're talking about the Iraq war, that became a substitute for, I think, true patriotism, which is speaking out on issues that are of importance to our national security. I decided I won't wear that pin on my chest. Instead, I'm going to try to tell the American people what I believe will make this country great, and hopefully that will be a testimony to my patriotism. We now continue with Kate Obenshane and Geraldine Ferraro. Should your patriotism, Kate, be judged by the size of your lapel pin? It's a little weird, Alan, that in the middle of the campaign, the guy takes off the American flag <laughs> that most people wear because they're proud of their country. It's a statement. Are you wearing a flag right and now? When you're, when you're running I don't see for your president, pen. When you're, Alan, when Where's you're running your for president, it says something. And if in the middle of the campaign, I think you, should you have take a pen. it off. Kate, come it on. Actually, oh, come on, Geraldine. He <laughs> says it. He uh, said he is making I a statement. I am walking around with a lapel pin. I also don't walk with a yellow bracelet. I don't walk around with a pink ribbon but if you want to ask me if I raise money for cancer research yes I do do I care about these things yes I do I don't need to let people know what I'm doing and I don't think wearing a, a, a flag on your lapel says that you're any more patriotic than the next let me get a Kate is the bigger the flag the, big, the more patriotic you are is that how it works you know what Alan the point is he uh, he took it off and he said I am making a statement here yeah. you have to say what does that statement mean, and how it's do I, as a voter, feel about right. it? Substance over it, symbolism. It That's what the statement something is. to our troops who are oh, in harm's way. Oh, it does. Well, the troops are really offended it's because he's not wearing a pin on his lapel. That real. hurts the troops? Get real. That hurts the troops. It's ridiculous. They're, they're in pain because Barack Obama Geraldine. took a pin off his chest. It, he is making a statement by it. And you can look at the other <laughs> things <laughs> that he said, and you can look at... It falls in line with some of the other you know, bizarre things that he says on foreign policy. It's not Alan, about let me finish. how loud you say the Pledge of Allegiance or how big your pen is. That's not what patriotism yeah. is. It's phony Actually, patriotism. Actually, I never said anything about how big your pen is. What I'm saying is that people are already have some serious doubts about whether or not you're really patriotic. Well, let's talk about your pen. Let's talk about your pen. What I'm saying is that people already have some serious questions about Barack Obama on who? foreign policy. Who does? A lot of Americans certainly not about his patriotism, Kate. Can I just speak you for are, a minute? Yeah, you've been speaking he's for quite a while. To, not about his patriotism. No one Thank questions you. his patriotism. You're being a little rude tonight. Well, it's because you don't stop talking, talking for goodness sake.